My name is, jo do not use that. I'm Joe Hamilton. Um, I've lost about 90 pounds using the principles laid out in the full plate diet and I've easily kept it off. I'm trying to give you all the good shots here. I just never really realized how heavy I was getting, I think. I couldn't understand why girls weren't looking at me anymore until I realized I was just gigantic. And I stood up on the scale and was like, wow, that's got to be wrong. And I told the other guy, stand on this. No, it's perfectly calibrated. Oh, crap, let me take off my boots. <laughs> I thought the springs were going to be busting out of it like on a cartoon, you know? You don't just change your weight when you do this. It kind of inadvertently changes how you think about food. There's a difference between feeling full and feeling disgustingly heavy after you've eaten a meal. And whereas before I'd go and I'd get like the big thing of chips and I had it stacked just a certain way and then they'd pile the meat on top of it and then go get queso and pour it all over the thing and then throw some guacamole on and just be like <laughs> Well, instead. <laughs> okay, leave that part out. <laughs> Anyway, you're more in command, more in control here. And it's not that it's a secret, weird cult of a lifestyle. It's not that you're eating tofu. I hate tofu, it's nasty. And it's not how fabulous do I do. It's more of, how do I feel? Hooray! That was a good shot right there, wasn't it? Second of all, it's sustainable. It's completely sustainable because you're losing all this weight and you're never really going hungry. And so when people tell you, wow, you're shedding weight, you're going, well, I don't feel like I am because I'm always eating something. You don't have to regiment, be regimented about what you're following in the book. It's just, here are a few tips and methods and things that you can do. Plow into this big pile of healthy food. I don't know, life just changes. It's different, you know? You don't go hide in your house because you're huge and you need to eat. You don't, you're not embarrassed to eat in public because you eat such quantities. And, it. it was funny, it was like, I'm gonna take this food home. <laughs> That's not even a part of my world anymore. It's just there are certain things in, in, in the world that just make a difference that you try them and they change your way of thinking. And this is just one of those things.